Welcome back to Dark Messiah of Might and Magic, Mr. Freeman. Welcome back. Let's ride with Alex up the elevator shaft. Don't kick it, pull it. Aura. I can't believe you're one of those. She wants to own you. She pours poison in your ears. Don't, Don't listen. listen. I'd like to tell you, but it's not a simple tale. Don't say anything. You can be cleansed of this. I know a way. I will talk to the priest at the sanctuary of Elath in Stonehill. If I may get out of here. If he hears from me, he will help you. His name is Deland. He's a good man. Don't listen to her. She has no idea who you are. She knows nothing of your power. I do. I saved your life. She's been using you. Now as you come to your birthright, she wants you to renounce your power? What sort of a friend is that? Hmm? What? What, is this supposed to be some sort of a, a moral quandary? I don't actually know where to go now, so I'm assuming I just follow her. I mean, I know I'm supposed to go to the uh, Necromancer's Lair, but I don't actually know where to go for that. Have you discovered Aaron Tyr's plans? No, not yet. Come on, let's go. Damn it! Rar. Yes, I boosted my way into the load zone again. What's up? Oh yeah, strats. <laughs> <laughs> landed on his head and kicked him, or I don't. I, I think I mean he might have just collapsed because of my weight. I don't even know. It's been a while since I played this game, so I really don't remember how to play. I just know I can jump uh, and I press buttons and people die. Also, I didn't explore in here. So what's in here? What is that? Don't move, heretic. Ugh. I don't want my juice. No, I want chocolate milk. Oh, I picked up the juice. No. Ooh. Uh, my is eager to Get down the stairs. Down the stairs. Down the stairs. Well. Wait, how did he freeze me? I'm on fire. This seems implausible. Magic mushroom time. Oh no, I used them all up on the spider. Uh health or eh. actually let's just shove all the food in my mouth mm. anybody else want to mess with me I'll claw your face off with my demon claws. Yeah. I was gonna do something. Oh yes, do I have enough skill points to do the things? I think I need 12 to do the things, right? Yeah, 12 for adrenaline and 12 for vitality? Yeah. All right, let's keep saving them. You know, I hope this game, I don't actually remember where the end of this game is. It feels like I'm near the end. But I'm hoping I'm not, or I'm hoping that they're gonna dump a crap ton of skill points in my lap, because I focused exclusively on melee attacks. I haven't put a single point into anything magical, and I'm still not even close to having, like, all critical hits as well as adrenaline. Or vitality as well. Like, I'm, I'm hoping these aren't things that I get right at the end of the game and I only have, like, 20 minutes to use them and then the game's over. I'd be pretty sad if that happened. I doubt it, though. I mean, I've done all the optional stuff. Which means I have as many skill points as is possible to actually get at this point in the game, I think. 
Get out of here. Down the stairs. I'm actually taking crap tons of damage. Well, that's weird. Why do they have all these like shackles and stuff to hold the bodies down? What's the point? They're skeletons. It's okay. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Shh, shh, shh. I really probably should use a full health potion. Eh, I'm stubborn. I really should probably use my shield. Oh god, the glow burns my eyes. No. You know, I should stop, actually, in here. Because I have that skill where if I stop for a second, it'll highlight any magical things. Or, uh, not magical, necessarily, but, uh, secrets. Yeah, there might be, like, a movable bed, like there was before or something. Hmm. I wonder if you can cut these. Nah, it doesn't seem like it. I'm thinking maybe you can make the orbs fall on... Well, I guess, what would they fall on? <laughs> fall on the tables where there's nobody there anyway? Other than a pile of skeletons? I guess that wouldn't be much use, would it? Okay, let's see, came from up there. Yes, 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 time to go this way. See if I can boost myself. Uh. Whee! I'm getting good at that, damn. It's weird, I'm better, I'm better at doing that than I was before. Even though I haven't actually practiced since I last played. It's kind of weird. To the portal! Wait. That's not the platform. The platform needs to come down. Does that mean I've already been on it? Or did this just lead in a circle? Hmm. I'm not entirely sure what's happening. I know I haven't actually been here before, because I obviously wasn't able to open these doors, but it's quite possible I've been... Oh yeah, yeah, I've been here. Well shit, where am I supposed to go? Find a way to enter the Necromancer's lair. Wait, no, that's done. Find Erentir and discover his plans. Right, there's Erentir's chamber, but fuck, where was that? I really don't remember. But I know I haven't been in here before. 
probably just extra extra stuff in here. Holy Pizalms. Yeah. Don't need no magic. I know there's some unopened places on the other side. Probably just extra rooms as well. Probably nothing special, but, uh... We'll go check them out anyway. Can't even pick it up. Oh, what's the book? I can't do anything with it. Hmm. Shadwin's Treatise of Improbable Reconciliations. That sounds intriguing. Chapter 3. There are thus conflicting prophecies treating the inflection point of the apotheosis. However, it could similarly be argued that these seemingly differing pros prognostications, that is the apotheosis and the dinocidal restriction, stem not from fundamentally opposed analyses of the propagational effects of the apotheosis throughout the continuum, but merely the identical conclusions of the inflection dynamic as observed via her heretofore unrelated points of reference. While certain philosophers may scoff at this theory, uniting previously disparate theses concerning the quarantine and the sentinel, acceptation of the fundamental argument would definitely reconcile extant factual data with the previously suspected yet unproven link intimately binding the related vessels both geographically and temporally. Damn, somebody's getting high off the juice. I just helped somebody kick their habit. <laughs> Literally, I just kicked their habit. Oh my god. I didn't even think of that pun. Damn, I'm so clever. I'm so clever that I actually made a pun that my own brain didn't even realize. Like, damn. Damn. That's good. I'm just kidding, it's not that clever. I'm not that egotistical. I feel like doing this. No! I want to launch myself off. Whee! <laughs> I like how he survived, but it says you die anyway. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. It's like your character's like, yeah, I'm fine, whatever, and the game's like, no, you dead. Your character's like, what? No, I'm not dead. No, 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 it's good. don't go to black, oh god! Wait, what was that? Oh, Theory of Magic? I've already read that before. Yeah, there's like no point in visiting these side rooms. They're just little bits and bobs that I really, really don't need. Scrolls that I'll never use, health potions that I can't pick up. Anyway, uh, that's where I originally came from all the way back there, so I need to... Maybe I should just go back down the elevator. I really think maybe I should. Um. Yeah, I've kind of totally forgotten where stuff is. I'm actually going to find something new. Somewhere I can go, and uh, when I do, I'll be right back. This must be his room. So where is his journal? Okay, well, that was um, a whole heck of a lot of wasted time. Yeah, I should not have gone up that lift. Going up that lift was, I think, where I need to go after I'm done with this. So, this is where Liana is, right? I went up there and went up the lift and all that, and I spent like eight minutes just wandering around this place. And where I needed to go was actually, like, 15 feet over here. This is Aaron Deer's chamber. So, uh, whoops. 
All right, I found a secret plans. We're good. Aaron Tears Memories. The Path of Bones. Those who fear death are f Aaron Tears Journal. Oh my god. I guess he doesn't travel much, right? Look at that journal. That is... That probably weighs like a hundred pounds. So I have opened a portal between Naharish and Stonehelm and used the word car, which means truck in the ancient Shantiri language, to unlock its power, as is proper. For deep within the heart of Stonehelm lies a necropolis, as old and venerable as any in this world. Normally I would take my pleasure there, venerate the dead, study their secrets, explore the wisdom of the ancient embalmers. Alas, such is not to be my fortune this time, for there I must invoke the power of the skull to summon death's own avatar, who is very blue and tall. May my efforts be worthy of Asha's praise. May the sacrifice of living souls of Stonehill be sufficient to imprison Kabbaleth until the day when the world is remade. What? He'll murder tens, hundreds of thousands. Madman, I won't let you destroy this city. Ooh, skill points. <gasps> I can get adrenaline without getting critical hit. I was worried I might need critical hit first. Allows you to uh, stock more adrenaline and inflict two fatalities. Funny thing is, I don't think that matters. How often do I actually get adrenaline kills? Honestly, pretty rarely. So, I think instead I'm just going to go with allows my health to regenerate. Which unfortunately doesn't tell me how fast it allows it to regenerate, so I don't know if it's great or not very good. But, I'll take it. Should stack on top of my ring of regeneration. Bingo! Now I just need to hurt myself to see how fast I heal. Liana, can you slap me? Oh wait, if I enter demon form, doesn't that suck my health? Oh yeah, there we go. God damn, my hands look cool. Oh, there we go. There's some damage. Alright, how fast do I regenerate? Alright, let's see. 54. 1. 2. 3. Okay, so it's about one hit point every three seconds. 1. 2. 3. Yeah, about one hit point every three seconds. Which means 80 times 3, which is 160, 240. Which means in 240 seconds I will regenerate all of my health. Okay. That's pretty good. I definitely think that's a lot more valuable than having adrenaline. Okay, did I, did I get what I came for? Escape through the portal? Aranger's absence searches room to find out his plans. Oh, I guess I did by reading his journal or whatever. The, oh, right, his Necropolis, Stonehelm stuff, stuff. Sure. Let's go. Now I'm going to spend two hours just trying to find Liana again. Did she leave? I just saw her. Did she go up here? Oh, there you are. Don't mind me, Liana. I'm just a demon flying through the air all the time. Yeah. I'll go first. Go through the portal. So that's back where we started, right? Uh, you lead the way. Oh, you expect me to know my way? Oh man, you're in for trouble. She's following me, isn't she? God, I, I just went back in my wanderings, but I don't remember where... Ah. Man, she's not going to be able to keep up. So 
hope her pathfinding doesn't screw her. Oh, here we go. Yeah, so this is the way I went when I was looking for where I was supposed to go, but this is obviously where you're supposed to go when you're completely done. <laughs> Let's see if she gets here before the lift gets here. Nope. Damn it, Alex, come on. Space! Holy crap, I'm tripping. Get me out of here. I have to stay here and close this portal, Sarath. What? I hate to leave you, but I must prevent more necromancers from coming through. Sarath, wait! Don't forget the sanctuary. Please. I miss the Sarath that I first met at my uncle's house. Don't listen to her. You are what you are. Don't be afraid. I I'm I'm not afraid. Why did you have to stay here again to prevent the necromancers from coming through? It's been like an hour and none of them have come through yet. What is she... She's like bobbing back and forth. Come on. There we go. I thought she might get a little bit of cold down here. Give her some warmth. All right, let's go. Ah, that's what Aaron Tears German meant. Huh? What? Return to Stonehelm via the via the sewers. By the way, the reason I keep practicing this uh, this glitch jump thing is not only because it's kind of fun, but also because I'm kind of practicing for attempting to speedrun this game. I'm going to try to speedrun it. We'll see. Uh, I still need to look at the route and see if it's any fun, but I believe the main the main the main way to actually just move fast in general is to use this. I think so. I'm trying to practice it, and it really is just a lot of fun. Oh, City of Flames. All right. Well, I guess I know what's about to happen. Aaron Deer has already arrived at Stonehelm, and he's burned stuff down. Don't let Liana fool you. She doesn't know what you really are. All she has done is use you to do her dirty work, and now she's asking you to give up your heritage, your destiny. Indeed. I seem to be surrounded by women who want things from me. Not for me, my love, for both of us. And believe me, what I want, you'll be happy to give. Uh, I don't think so. Don't go out there! You'll leave the ghouls here! You'll get us both killed! <laughs> You'll be okay. Here. Use those to defend yourself. Use this, too. Make yourself a new weapon if it gets dull. Ah, shoot, he doesn't even have a forge. Ah, well. Dunk. This one is quite a survivor. Finally! I was worried that the necromancers had done for you. They're all over the city. You know a way to get through the battle to the necropolis? Not me. My cousin Percy. He knows every inch of the tunnels and sewers under the city. Don't tell I me I'm going back to the tunnels and sewers again. Something happens. Help me! Help me, please! Burn the city to the ground! If Percy hates you or Percy dies, blah blah blah, mission over. Okay.
should probably just kick him into the spikes. Oh, out of stamina. Get, in, get into the spikes. <laughs> Come on, stamina. There we go. Oh no, he didn't hit him. He bounced off the body. <laughs> I'm liking the monster yoga going on there. Alright, let's kick him down the stairs. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Oh shit, I'm about to die. Oh fuck. I didn't realize my health was so low. Those little buggers are kind of hard to hit. All my adrenaline. I want to do the crouch thing, even though it's probably going to be totally ineffective. Oh, nice. Actually, save him this time. Nice dodge, actually. Well, he was quite a survivor. Spamming attacks is actually very effective. Should probably keep doing it. Get over the edge. Two for one. <laughs> now I get the adrenaline. I really should use the shield. Whoa! Decapitation. They actually do dodge pretty well. Hmm. Hmm. Potential secrets? Hmm. Ah, oh, it's not wood. Can you shoot an arrow, a bow, a, a bow arrow, a rope arrow, that's the word I was looking for, I was like bow arrow, bow arrow what, bow shoot arrows, yes, <laughs> can you shoot, shoot a rope arrow into a, into like a box, into something you can move, nah, it just destroys it damn, because if you could do that, you could probably do some pretty crazy stuff, you know, like shoot it into a barrel and then like throw the barrel on top of something and use it like a grappling hook kind of thing, That'd actually be pretty cool. I think the physics engine would have a hard time coping with it, though. I mean, the ropes are already really funky. I can only imagine how funky they'd get if you did that. Wait, where the hell am I supposed to go? Whoa! What the fuck? Oh my god, the game almost killed me. Alright. Gotta remember, don't get on ropes when you first shoot them, because they're going all over the place. That's probably a speedrun strat, actually. Jump on a... There's probably all sorts of rope glitches. C come on. Come on, get get through the hole. Get get through the hole. Oh yeah, that was pointless. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Find Percy. Uh huh. Oh, 
Oh. Uh, you Percy? That was close. I damn near rusted my armor from the inside out. Are you Percy? Thank you for the help. What do you... Where? What? Okay. It's like, whoa, I forgot my next node. Let's go to my last node. No, let's go to my next node. I gotta be really careful not to hit him. I was expecting more of a fight. <laughs> oh god, it's on fire! Get it out of my hands! Oh Jesus! Oh, he's dead. All right, I guess he's not Percy. Whoa! 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 What are you doing? Oh wait, are you an enemy or? Wait, are you a guard or an enemy? I don't understand. You look like a guard, kinda. I guess not. <laughs> Gotta keep an eye out for secrets. Mm. Hmm. Hmm, there's something up there. Something going on. Is that wood? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, come on, that's wood. Ooh, secrets? Aha! Wait, that's it? Just a full health potion? Huh. I feel insulted. Maybe there's more down here. Oh. Are you Percy? You're probably Percy. Hold on. Another secret. They're mine. Eh, actually, I can't hold them. I'm sorry, do you want them back? I was gonna throw these over, but I just realized I threw the whole stack of 20 over the, the ledge, so that's probably a bad idea, so let's not do that. <laughs> I don't know how to split the stack. I don't even know if you can. Maybe, could you like hold down control or something? Shift? Alt? Right, right, oh, right click use. Eh, whatever. This does drop them all, right? Oh no, it only drops one. Okay. Hey, what's going on? Hey. You want one? There you go. You must be Sarah. Yes. And you'd be Percy? Can you lead me to the necropolis? Oh, sure. Through the aqueducts. I used to work on the aqueducts. There's a path through the flow valves. How do we get there? How? Tell me quickly. Come on. So forceful. There's a Cyclops sitting right across the path. No one's getting anywhere with him there. Get me to the valve control house and I'll get you inside. But now, there's an undead Cyclops outside. I'm not going unless you can kill it, find another route, or lead it away while I cross to the other side of the square. Okay, sounds like multiple ways to approach the situation. Save your strength for Aaron here. Is this an optional objective? Nope, just get Percy to the other side of the plaza, guarded by the Cyclops. Apparently it's an undead Cyclops, too. That should be fun. Also, a bow of fiery rage. <gasps> I can't use it, but it sounds cool. You think he, Percy would freak out if he saw me as a demon? Stay where you are. Yep. You scared Percy with your demon form. 
He didn't seem very scared, honestly. It's only the guard that freaked out, but all right. All right, let's go. Screw the shield. Don't need it. It's annoying. He said I could find another way across. Um. Whoa, 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 dude, calm down. Stop. Okay, you're gonna you're gonna stay there, right? You're not gonna keep going. All right. Let's see if this is another way. Wait, that's not wood, is it? No, damn it. Uh, that's wood, though. No. Uh, that's wood. Yeah. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's hunting out some nice, hard, thick wood to shoot my... Nah, I couldn't finish that. It didn't work. I could probably retire just by prying the the jewels from that jewel encrusted spine. Just pull them out, sell them on the market, and retire. Ah, killing it's optional. Okay. Well, it's already undead. He's not getting himself killed, is he? Oh, there's a key. So I can just let him through here, right? Oh, shit, there's even civilians here. Run! Hide! Cower in fear! <laughs> Smooth animation transitions. Ooh, look at that bounce. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Wait, was he humming? Oh, at least they got some pigs here. Wait, what did you just say? I want to hear him say say something again. Did he just yawn? <laughs> you could what? <laughs> Finish the story. I'm in suspense. Oh my god. Alright, so it, it doesn't quite cancel out their normal, like, idle uh, barks. Even though they're in fear. Nice. I love this game. Alright, this is what was logged, right? No. This is what was locked. There we go. Uh, no candles for you. Just a health potion? Lame. Really? A secret room with one health potion and two things you can open in suspense and there's nothing inside of them. Wow. Nothing else, huh? All right. Thank you. Yo. All right, so this is the alternative pathway, I think. So that's gonna get him across safely. But I want to do the oh, sweet. I want to do the optional objective of killing the Cyclops. I swear, those are the same opening sound effects that I've heard in, like, Penumbra or Amnesia. Eh, get out of here. Alright, well, I can kill the Cyclops with this. This should do. Drink my bitter brew. It has no tea. It, uh, the fuck. I messed it up. Never mind. Okay, there's probably some sort of an environmental thing. I don't imagine stabbing it's going to be very effective. At least not with my sword. And again, I really don't 
see, like, I don't really see a statue that could fall in it or anything like that. Nothing that would be reminiscent of the way I killed the last one. So maybe I do just stab it. Did I miss something? Whoa, no, 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 no. No, that's it. Oh, come on. Let me jump over. I'm gonna jump over, no matter what you want me to do, game, I'm jumping over. There's that, there's that. Alright, we're gonna get you safely across. Don't worry about it, man. Great job. Let's go. Are you good? Alright, so this is all I need to do, but I can also go try to kill the thing, which is probably gonna turn into another, like, hour long uh, spider boss fight. Most likely. So I think I'm going to save that for the next episode because it might turn out pretty lengthy. I'm also curious if you can get up here, but I think there might be an invisible wall. I should probably stop trying to get up here. Alright, forget it. <laughs> anyway, oh hi. You can't fit under there, can you? No, thank God. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, I'm going to try to stab this undead Cyclops to re-death.